thanks very much for coming. Thank you. Okay, so, so um, how does it feel now it's coming to an end? Ah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, it, it feels, it's been the longest course, but it feels like too soon now. Um, it's sort of almost like the more you know, the less you know. <laughs> and, um, and now it's sort of like, we're going to have to get on with it. And it's like, that's quite a scary sort of proposition. It's, it's quite nice being in the nurturing uh, position of being a student. <laughs> okay. And looking back, why did you do it? What were your motivations for um, starting out? Well, I think that I knew I wanted to study something. I wasn't really sure. Uh, Elizabeth was very good at uh, suggesting that I did the foundation course first and that I could just do that and leave it at that. Yeah. Um, but once I did that, I really felt hooked on finding out more. Yeah. Um, very interested in people and very interested in how the brain works. So uh, it just seemed like the right thing for me to do. Okay, great. And in, in what way, it, given that it seemed like the right thing to do, in what way has the experience met your expectations? Um, well, I think uh, I wasn't really sure quite, I didn't like particularly the sound of being an NLP practitioner because it all sounds a bit strange. Yeah. Um, but uh, I seem to have hooked onto something called intuitive uh, NLP now, and that seems to sit very comfortably with me, and I feel that that's the way I should start to work towards working. Okay. And, and apart from, well not apart from, including intuitive NLP, how do you feel about your uh, technical NLP competence? Oh, I, I feel that um, I've been working with um, some case studies yeah. uh, throughout the course and yeah. actually when I'm doing it I feel very confident and very happy with the progress I've made really. I right. uh, just, need, just need to keep on doing it. Okay, great. So I was going to ask you when you consider the future how confident are you about your skills, your NLP skills. Yeah, I think I'm confident. I think yeah. that it just needs to, uh, you just need to have, a, you know, just practice. Practice is part of the, the, the learning, really. Yeah. Um, and uh, yeah, I feel very, I feel now very confident about what I know, really. Okay. And do you consider it to have been a good investment of your time and money? Oh, it's been great. I mean, it's yeah. been fabulous. It, I, yeah. The money just seems to have been forgotten about, really, yeah. um, because I think. I've changed a lot myself and I've had my own journey which has run parallel with the learning so um, I feel like everything's moved forward in a great way and so the money's been incidental really. Okay, lovely. Um, can you give me an idea of how you've already used it? Um, yes, I, I work I work in a salon with clients and yeah. already I'm able to, to be to do more probably a little bit more specific um, help for them right and also with my own um, family and friends definitely friends I've worked with um, who've made serious leaps and bounds so right. it's been really it's been really exciting okay lovely okay and finally then is there anything else <laughs> Elizabeth's a great teacher <laughs> and a great person <laughs> I wouldn't have missed, missed it for the world <laughs> thank you very much <laughs>